Hey guys, I have no way to info TikTok that we're live right now. <laughs> <laughs> How are my beautiful people in this life? Our thumbnails are always so weird. Well, look at Mr. Long, Mr. Zainab, you're back. <laughs> nice to have you back. Our thumbnails are like. always so weird. Our thumbnails are always so weird, guys. I'm a little bit overly excited in the thumbnails. Hi, Dakota. Hi, Uncanny. We we leave. Oh, snap. It'll go really fast now. Daylin. Lillian. Cat. I am early. Hello, guys. Do you guys know what we're doing on this live? Someone say they make boba. I love boba, and I just made some today. Walaikum as brothers and sisters in Islam. Boba time. <laughs> I'm going to be completely honest with you guys. Mubina likes boba. I'm not a big fan of boba. And we're just going to try and see if we can make something good. Try it out. We've got the boba cooking on the stove. <laughs> cooking up a little bit. It's cooking in there, the little tapioca stuff. It's just... Can you pass me the, the raw ball, honey? Oh yeah, he's gonna try some. So guys, I ate, like, we were just on a Discord live and I ate one of these raw. So I'm gonna just do it again. We're gonna try it out. He's trying raw boba. Okay, yo, just one. There's like a whole <laughs> Oh, how about you eat all of them? I promise I don't wanna no. eat them. Oh no, no, thank you. <laughs> this is a raw boba. And I ate one earlier and it didn't taste so great. So we're gonna try it out and see if it's any better. This is really that smile on me. I'm not trying to taste? be rude, it's like Eat all of this. No, I promise. Eat all of it. Oh. All of it, all, all of it. Okay. Ah uh, the little plane <coughs> goes ah uh. <laughs> The little plane just goes by. <laughs> <laughs> uh, I'm sorry guys, it's not for me. I'm not trying to be rude. I give that like a 1 out of 10. I do not like that flavor tasting medicine. That's so mean! I don't like, okay, when I'm having my juice, I just want to have like my juice with the little balls on the bottom. I just want to like drink my juice. So, unless there's a chocolate flavored boba drink and there's no tapioca at the bottom, it's chocolate chips or something, then I'm good. Calm down, Madiha. Boba's from my culture. Please say Aries. Hello, Aries. Nice. Mohammed, shout out to you. Teeny teen boy. Love your channel. Say hi to me. Which boba? Brown sugar. Yes, we have brown sugar. You should try making the raindrop cake next. What is that? I don't know this one. Guys, I can't make that. That's way too hard. <laughs> what jobs can Muslim men do and what jobs can't they do? I mean, there's certain jobs that we should stay away from regardless. Um, for example, if you're working with interest, if you're working in banks, if you're working with alcohol, if you're working with haram food, these would be jobs that like I would personally avoid. There's other jobs as well. I don't know off the top of my head the differences between men and women jobs which men can do, women can't. Or it's my birthday. Oh wow, happy birthday. You guys are amazing. Thank you. Do you guys live in a new house different from your house tour? Love your beauty. So we actually have not done a house tour yet. Our house is not set up to do one. We might just end up just doing it as as our house as is. We have some artwork that's supposed to be coming into our house. So, I don't know. If you guys want to see a raw house tour, let us know. But it's really not set up in a nice way. I promise it'll taste good with the tea. Also, add brown sugar. Yes, we have that. Thank you. Hi, Sophia. Will you have kids, inshallah? Love you, Mubina. <laughs> Muad, happy birthday. Brother, I don't think saying Bismillah or Rahman Rahim is necessary. Just say Bismillah. I've heard of a different opinion on it. So, I mean, there's nothing wrong with saying Bismillah to Rahman Rahim. If you guys want to say just Bismillah, you can do that. But I just say the full thing. I love the stand mixer color, thank you. It is a nice color. 
I, I bet my house would be way worse. Our house is just not very um, aesthetic, I guess I would say. Our house doesn't have a very nice aesthetic right now where it's like, wow, it's nice to show. Mm -hmm. Not that we want to show off or anything, but like it just is very basic. We don't have anything on the walls right now. We have pictures we have to hang up and stuff, so it just looks very basic, but very plain walls. So guys, we are not making bubble tea with jasmine tea. We're going to use black tea. Is that good? I don't Wait, know. Wait, they had green and black tea at the store, so I, I'm sure it's okay. How long did it take you to learn how to put on your hijab the way you do now? Was it ever confusing? Um, it's still confusing, even today. <laughs> <Okay>. <laughs> but at least I found something that doesn't come off for me. The biggest issue with hijabs is not like how I put it on, it's so that it doesn't come off. So I have figured out a way where it doesn't come off at this point. So I'm happy with that. That's what makes me feel content. As long as it stays on your head, then you're content, eh? I know. Content, I know. I like milk tea. Mubina has... Mubina's... Uh, do you guys, have you guys guessed what flavors they are? I don't even think you guys know the flavors. Our Discord knows. Let me see knows. our Instagram. Guys, How guess the flavor. People have guessed. Which flavor are we going to make for the boba? You guys don't even know the flavor. So 12 people guessed it right. Mango honeydew. You just gave them the answer. Oops. <laughs> <laughs> oh, man. It's okay. It's okay. A, okay. So you guys want to guess who? Alright. Uh, people guessed it <laughs> Pretend right. you didn't hear that. <laughs> I actually had bubble tea yesterday and I hated it. I don't like it either. I don't know if I ever will. What is with you people that don't like bubble tea? I don't tea? want tapioca in my juice. Like, I just want to drink my juice. He's like, why are there random balls in my juice? <laughs> is there a way you can sing the alphabet? What? Sing the the alphabet, alphabet in Arabic? I might make a video on it. I'm not going to do it right now. Sing it. Sing it, sing it, sing Our it. Are poor removers haram? I don't want to give a ruling on anything, guys. As far as I know, using a pore remover, as long as you're not trying to like really damage yourself, I'm not going to give a ruling, guys. What? From my understanding, it's okay, but I'm not going to, I'm not going to say like, it's halal or haram. I don't know. What remover? Pore, pore remover. What's a pore remover? Look for your skin. Pore remover? Yeah. I, I don't want to, I don't want to, like, Guys, there's that nothing wrong with pore removers. Yeah. I'm not sure why you would ask, um, like, is, did you hear that someone said that it's not allowed in Islam? Mochi. My name is Wasika, and I will subscribe now. That's awesome. That's awesome. Thank appreciate you. appreciate you. We're making it at home. We do have the ingredients. I guess this is from scratch at home, but it's not like, like, some of the ingredients, we all have the ingredients to put together and make the global. How hard is it to make boba? We don't know. So that's we're basically doing an experiment now to see how difficult it is. And if you guys watch, you'll see whether it's easy or not to make from home. So basically, we have these tapioca balls that we got from like an Asian oh, cool. store. You guys can find it at any Asian store, pretty much. And then we have, um, like for the mango, I'm going to be making the mango slushy myself with real mango chunks. But for the honeydew part, I have the honeydew flavor powder. This has the tea within it, so I'm going to be using this to make the bubble tea. Mm -hmm. If you guys are enjoying it so far and you're, you want to see boba, smash the like button. Yeah, guys, give us likes so see that it. more people can like, see this video. Yeah, our lives, <laughs> for some reason, fail. never reach people. I don't know why on YouTube, so you guys who are here, we appreciate you. I don't know why it doesn't reach, but smash the like button, guys. Uh, are you okay, honey? No, I'm falling on you. <laughs> Mango and honey do. So, mango is a separate flavor, honeydew is a separate flavor. We're not going to mix them together. Y'all keep chocolate. Thank you. Appreciate you, Sky. Thank you guys who... Let you us know, are you guys new subscribers or are you guys people who have been here before? Are you guys our, like, our previous subscribers who have been with us? Or are you guys new? You know what I would like to know, Garrett? Where is your cup? Summer starts on TikTok. Where is yours? I don't know where it is. Where is your cup? I don't know. Where is your cup? I love, they love your hat, honey. Thank you, guys. I don't know why I'm, I'm wearing a, a hat and a jacket in the I'm kitchen. So, it's okay. like extremely hot. I don't know why I'm killing myself like this. Uh, yeah, it's crazy, honey. I'm kind of crazy. Previous sub, we appreciate you guys. I just subscribed one person, but I'd like to thank you, Caitlin. New subscriber from the GTA, Abalone. Awesome. Restorfia, I'm a subscriber, awesome. We're the aesthetic. Love y'all. We love you guys. 
all of you guys who are here who have joined, uh, welcome to our channel. We do live sometimes where we cook foods and we try to respond to you guys. We appreciate your support a lot and we like interacting with you guys and this is our way that we like to connect. We also do have a Discord uh, as well. It's a way of supporting our channel if you guys want to. There's no pressure if you want to, but it's basically a community there. We do some private Discords every week as well. So if you want to like be able to ask us questions in a smaller community where we can respond to all your questions, you can also join the Discord if you'd like. Rian, thank you so much. Yes, I do remember you. Walaikum as remember me from last week. Yes, we do. And we appreciate you so much. Thank you for being here. Walaikum as What do you do for a living? So my careers have changed a little bit over time. Right now I'm basically a social media manager for our social media and I also do content. A lot of people don't consider content creation a job, but I can tell you guys something from doing this for the past over two years. It's a lot of work. It's a lot. Uh, I've done full-time jobs as well, but this is it's very busy. You're working e like every day, but it's a lot of fun as well. So there's pros and cons. But it's I really a enjoy lot it. of fun. It's a lot of fun. <laughs> I love your channel. My best friend is also from Islam, and I've been watching you guys for a few months, and you guys give so much great info on Islam. Alhamdulillah. Thank you. So it says to like cook this for in, on medium low heat so you, for you 30 minutes, and I have to stir it every 10 minutes. So as you guys can see, it looks if you want like, me to stir or do anything, let me like know. Like tapioca balls right now, but I don't know. Let me know if you need a hand, honey. I don't need a hand yet. Not yet. But I might need it later. Okay. After yeah. you eat all of these balls. Yeah. Oh no. Please eat all of them. Well, it's really bad tasting. You just like swallow it. All of that. Yes. All of it. Put it in your hand and swallow it. Yeah. Swallow it. <laughs> okay guys, give me likes for eating. <laughs> I'm just kidding. <laughs> Do swallow I have to eat this? it. Do I have to eat this? Swallow it. It tastes so bad. Swallow it. I dare you. Yeah, I probably taste bad. Guys, you want him to eat this or no? Say yes. Yes, if you want him to eat it. Say no if you don't want me to eat it. Yes. Yes, yes, yes. I don't see any yeses yet. No, they're coming. The comments are coming. Yes, yes, yes. They're coming. Yes, yes. Somebody said yes. Yes, yes. Oh, snap. Walaikum salam. Oh, snap. Okay, guys. You have to eat it. Bismillah rahman Yes, I'm saying the full phrase. <laughs> I love you. Yeah. I love you so much. Why don't you eat it too? No. <laughs> it's like if you take a bunch of Tylenol and you just throw it in your mouth. Ew, is that what it tastes like? <laughs> I'm so sorry, I didn't know it tasted like that. He said it tastes like a tapioca. It's really dry and like powdery too. <laughs> Sticky. Sticky. Oh, it's sticking together. <laughs> I'm done. Can I'm you have so water? Yes. You can. It's like a desert in here. <laughs> in my mouth. It's so dry. I feel so bad. Ew. I'm sorry. I'm sowy. I'm sowy. This is gonna take a while. It's chewy. Chew, chew, chew. Shrek. We, hey, me and my family are huge fans. Can we get a shout out? Shrek Club. Absolutely. Shout out to you. We appreciate you. Make sure it's fully cooked, yo. Yeah, we, we thank you for that. We definitely will make sure it's cooked. That's kind of what we're trying to do right We're now. from Canada, for you guys wondering. Sky, we're from Canada. Well, I oh, it smells that. really good, though. It smells like... What does it smell like? <laughs> I can't describe it. I wish these drinks had, like, chocolate chips at the bottom or something. Hey, how are you doing? Wanted to tell you you have a beautiful relationship. Lots of love from Mexico. Awesome, and Thank you so much. Wait. We have. We love Mexico. I love Mexican food too. I need authentic halal Mexican. You know what I would like to try? You know fruit roll-ups? I would like to freeze that and I would like to try that. Fruit roll-ups? Yeah, frozen fruit roll-ups. I saw someone doing it on TikTok. It's so bad. We should do a live where we try TikTok hacks. I'm Fail or win. I'm going to convert to Islam. Any tips? I mean, if you're, if you're in a position where you've done your research and you're ready to do it, I mean... There's no, I think there's no reason to delay if you want to do it. Um, don't let anyone pressure you to do it. Make sure you know that your intention is that what you want to do. It's in your heart that you want to take that step. And then there might be some challenges. You don't have to be a perfect Muslim. 
when you convert, you don't have to know Arabic, you don't have to know how to do certain things. Just have a core understanding of, like, for example, the basics of the religion. Study it for a bit. If you feel like you want to do it, then go for it. Guys, let us know if you want us Yo, to do a live. It disappeared. I'm sorry. It disappeared. What do you mean it disappeared? It was it was chunky and like uh, squishy in my mouth. It disappeared. <laughs> yes, it's gone. It's so weird, yo, guys. It like evaporated in my mouth. I don't know where it went. <laughs> I was chewing it a second ago. Okay, so guys, if you want us to do a live where we like try TikTok hacks, let us know because I would like to do that. TikTok hacks. I want to try some they, TikTok hacks. They want you to read their comment. Viral TikTok hacks. Which comment? Walaikum Assalam, Mubina, can you please read my comment? Army Jump Hook. Yeah. Where is it? Yeah. Assalamu alaikum, Mubina, can you please read my comment? I read your comment, Army of Jump Hook. So, guys, the Discord link, I don't know how to add from here. I, I tried doing this last time, I kind of messed it up. The Discord link is on our Instagram, it is on our TikTok page as well. I'll try to add a link after the live. Guys, we posted a video today, and it's the link is in the description on that too. Yeah, so go to our it's other videos. It's in the about section. It's everywhere, literally. Like, you can find it. It's yeah. all around. Go in the descriptions of some of our previous videos on our channel. You'll find it there. You guys are my favorite YouTubers. Thank you. Thank you. And we do apologize, guys, because some of you guys wanted to see more vlogs on our channel. We have, it's just been really busy lately. We haven't had a chance to do vlogs. We did have a, a nice Niagara Falls vlog that we wanted to share. I really like that one, but then it, it just had issues when we uploaded it. No, I think it was because your phone, it wasn't loading, it wasn't, uh, it was full. Guys, that's one problem we have with the technology today. When the memory is full, we can't record more stuff on the phone. So, okay. Rubina, I subscribe. Thank you, Mohammed. Now I'm craving ice cap. Shout out for Poppy. What do I need to know about Islam before converting as a teen? Just understand, um, just look up the core values and the beliefs of the religion, watch some YouTube videos. You can just, I did a lot of my research online. If you have books and you go to the library, you can do that too, but sometimes the books have like information that's not like, it's not correct sometimes. I don't know if a non-Muslim wrote the books, but sometimes it has like some off information. But there's a lot of great books as well, of course, but just have an understanding of the core beliefs of the religion. Seven more minutes to and I can like rinse the tapioca with cold water. And yeah. With cold water. Another thing I would say is maybe start like trying to practice it. For example, before I became Muslim, I started doing the. I started learning about the prayers. I started actually trying to do them. I fasted before. I went to a mosque before. I converted. Um, I think these are good things that you can do to see uh, how you how you like it. Um, we don't necessarily do these things because we like them, but it is part of our worship for God. Oh, she was sleeping and then she woke up. It would be a rare sleeping moment. I have to take COVID tests in eight more days. Please pray for me. May Allah subhanahu wa ta'ala make it easy for you. Amen. And successful. Amen. Amen. Guys, I'm such a big fan. Language Central, thank you so much. We see you guys' comments. Even if we can't respond to every single one, we're trying our best. This is why you guys should join the Discord if you want us to respond to you frequently because that's where we do our lives before this live we actually had a live before this one that was only private for our discord community chess is haram i just found out oh my god i've been playing it for my whole life according to the opinion that we follow chess is impermissible there is a difference of opinion on it um so just do your research ask a scholar allah knows best this is hard i have to like stuff it into the freezer my school teaches Quran. Do you guys have any? Are you okay? Yeah. Let me know if you want me to mix. Your hands be sore, Mubina. I can mix for you. It's okay. Mubina's injured her hand. Guys, keep Mubina in your prayers. I'm, I'm not joking. Yeah, I'm guys, serious. I can't she actually hurt her it. hand. I can't bend it. It's hard. Her hand's been in a lot of pain. She cut her hand. Was it yesterday? You cut yeah, your hand. Yeah, I cut my finger. She cut her finger yesterday. Her hand's kind of struggling. So, guys, keep her in your duas. I also want to tell her to give her shifa. I mean, oh, I forgot that. I'm um, saying that. Have to. Difference of opinion, yes. Uh, Abster Bone, thank you for that. Face reveal when? I think that someone. Did. <laughs> I've never had someone do that and then ask for a face reveal. <laughs> Donate and then face reveal. You I, guys have a face reveal right here. I am half of Medina TV, so you get That's a, half, a face reveal. Half face reveal. I know. I hope she gets better. 
Thank you. Thank you guys for guiding me to Islam. I'm thinking about being a Muslim because of you guys. Thank you. Namju's crab, man. Allah bless you. <laughs> Alhamdulillah, that's amazing. We're really happy to hear that. Um, if you have any questions, let us know. We'll try to respond. Although, like I said, easiest to reach us in the Discord if you guys have questions because we get swarmed with Instagram DMs and all kinds of stuff. If you guys are not following us on Instagram, a way of supporting us is also just follow us on Instagram. That would mean a lot. Can mothers bathe their child if they did not hit puberty? Mubina? Yeah. Can mothers bathe their bathe their child if they have not hit puberty? Um I think you should talk to a scholar about that. Because it it's depends on fuzzy. how you measure puberty. It also depends on how mature your child is. Depends on a lot of factors. Right, we're talking about baby, obviously, yeah, your mother can wash the baby, but when yeah. you start getting closer to that age it gets a little bit more Like my mom stopped giving me baths when I was like what, seven? <laughs> The Discord. Is there a way, Mubina, we can add the Discord link in the description? Of this live? Yeah. I can try doing it. If you're able to, that would be good. I can stir if you need me to. No, well. no, it's okay. You don't need to stir that much. That's the thing. I'm such a huge fan. Can you and Mubina give me a shout out? Harley, shout out to you. We appreciate you. Muhammad, shout out to you. Please notice me. I've been trying from your last live. Please, Ashley, I'm sorry if you were there in the last live. We didn't see it, but we see it now. We appreciate you a lot. You guys are such an inspiration. Please keep inspiring me, inspiring the community. You have helped me in a lot of tough times. May Allah always keep you guys happy. Um, JazakAllah khair. May Allah subhanahu wa ta'ala bless you and reward you. We're, we appreciate that, guys. We're humble, but I don't know. I'm very humbled by you guys' kindness. You guys are very kind. And I do want to apologize to you guys about something. Our YouTube comments, if you guys are ever in our videos, you might see a lot of like hateful comments some really disturbing comments in there we are sorry about that we are trying to moderate that the best we can but some of our videos especially the ones that go very viral they blow up in the wrong places and then we get a lot of like islamophobic comments in there it doesn't personally affect us but i know some of you guys might find it frustrating to see that in our comment section so we are sorry about that but it's refreshing to see a lot of nice uh comments from you guys so thank you for that yeah i've added it in the description Okay, thank you. So guys, you can check the description of this live to see uh, the Discord. It is like a kind of like a sign up for the Discord. It is a way of supporting our channel. There's no pressure, but it means a lot when you guys do join it. And we, if you do join, you will get access to a Discord server with other members. So if you guys are looking to learn about Islam or be part of a community, it's not a huge community, but there are people in there and people are very friendly and respectful. We love our Discord. So that's like our family outside of the YouTube, TikTok, and everything, our little small family, so we'd love to have you guys part of it. Tighten it, yes. Do you plan on going to Mecca? Yes, inshallah. Why did you choose the name Mehdi Isa? Just wondering, by the way, it really fits you. Thank you. Um, I just learned kind of about, like, uh, uh, Imam Mehdi, alayhi salam, Isa, alayhi salam. The name I was going to go with originally was Isa, after Jesus, peace be upon him, from... I was Christian before I converted to Islam and I love Jesus, peace be upon him. I'm sure there's a lot of you guys who love Jesus as well, peace be upon him. So I wanted to name myself after him. I thought it was pretty cool to name myself after him. And then Ivan Mehdi alayhi salam. Uh, Mehdi means the guided one, but that's what the name means. And I thought it was a really nice name. And those two come in, his, in, you know, in the future. They come at the same time. Um, uh, it, it's kind of similar to the last days in like in the Christian belief um, but there's also Imam Mehdi al-Islam who exists in our belief as well so I just thought it was cool how the two figures come at the same time the meanings of the name and just Jesus was that's the main name that I wanted to choose and Mubina's family also said Mehdi was a nice name too so I'm like let me just have both names let's have two names instead of one I love y'all but I'm broke uh oh sorry it's okay. I love the bucket hat. It's really fun, and let's hope the bubble tea goes well. You guys are so cool sharing about your culture. I think people need to know more about other cultures and religions. Thank you. Thank you. When I became Muslim, there weren't a lot of resources for someone who was trying to learn um, Islam in a simple way. We aren't scholars, but we do share what we follow and practice. So the videos that you guys see are from the opinions that we take from scholars 
and it's the way that we live our life on a day-to-day -day basis. So, I should I convert from Christian? I don't want to tell you guys to convert. Is it? Almost the timer. Okay. Time to take this off. I don't. I don't want to tell you guys to leave your religion. I. It's. It should be something that you want to do yourself. I don't think it would be right to tell you that. It has to be something that you want to do yourself. Have you guys ever been confused for another religion or race? Oh, it smells so mm. good. You say it smells good. You're straining it right now. It smells so good. Sometimes I get confused for another race. Um, but I don't know. Mubina, do you get confused for a different race? Well, I'm wearing a veil, so... <laughs> <laughs> I'm also eating bubble tea. It's so good. I love your channel and your culture. I hope you have a wonderful day and you are so kind. Thank you. We hope you enjoy your bubble tea. I'm still trying to understand the hype behind the bubble tea because I've just not enjoyed the ones I've had, but maybe this one will be different. Let's see. I don't think so. I want to be Muslim, but I don't think my parents would be okay with it. That's a difficult situation to be in. That was a situation I was in. In Islam, we believe, you know, if you know, we have to respect our parents and hold our parents to a high degree, but if they're telling you that you can't, you know, follow Islam, for example, like my parents told me not to be Muslim, I still converted to Islam. So in that respect, we don't have to listen when they tell you not to be Muslim, but like, otherwise you should be respecting your parents as much as possible. Okay, I want you to try the cook ball now. Okay, let's try it. I don't know if this is going to be much better, guys. I'm sorry. Oh, it's yeah. black. Yeah, it has to be black. It changed color, guys. <laughs> Do I just grab it? Yeah, just grab one and eat it. Jelly. Yeah, it is. <laughs> Wanna show it, buddy? It looks like a little black pearl. It is a black pearl. Okay, guys, just me that right now. How is that? <laughs> <laughs> um, How is that? It's better than the raw one, that's for sure. Better it's than chewy. The raw one. Not much flavor, it's chewy. Let go. How do people know if you're Muslim or not when traveling to Mecca? Um, at the airport in Jeddah, I think they find out. I'm not sure exactly how, but um, I don't remember how. <laughs> I got a, con my, myself personally, I got a conversion certificate that says I converted to Islam. Just as like some form of documentation, because my name right now is not legally changed. My legal name is Garrett, so like if I go to like, Garrett, that's not a Muslim name. So I have documentation to show that I am a Muslim, even though I haven't officially changed my name legally. I can really respect your culture, and it's so cool that you guys can be different and show your culture and be proud of it. It's also had bubble tea this afternoon. It's good. Thank you so much. We appreciate you guys. I will clarify something that our Islam is not really a culture. It is more of a religion. And we also have videos talking about culture versus Islam as well. Not all things are bad about cultures. There's good and bad in cultures, but our religion isn't necessarily a culture. Okay. Um, thank you. I, I, I know what your intention is behind what you're saying, but thank you. Time to drizzle brown sugar. Yes, we do have like a, a sacred. It's called the Quran. I don't mean to pry, just kind of curious if there's a book. Yes. Um, so we actually, as Muslims, we do believe in like the Bible and the Torah and the Psalms as well as the Quran. But the Quran is the book that we follow. But for example, we have a Bible in our house as well. So you have to believe in the holy books. I'm just going to incorporate this. You guys want to read? Sugar? Can you show it to them? Sure. There are online versions of the Quran in English, guys, if you are interested in reading it. It's a really beautiful book to read. Whoa, what is that? I'm just incorporating the brown sugar and it's going to melt right into it. It's going to make it sweet. Brown sugar? I don't have the syrup or honey. I mean, you can use honey as well, but we're using brown sugar. Because that's what we have. But it's so fast. The process is like... It's fast. Wa alaikum assalam. Allah afqo. Tan from India. Love back. 
can there be Muslim Jews? I'm Muslim, but I just don't know the answer to that. I'm not a Jew, though. I was just asking, though, also, can Muslims do acting job? Um, you could be Jewish and convert to Islam. Anyone can convert to Islam. Um, Muslim acting jobs, it depends on what kind of job it is. If they're doing things that are haram, then they should not They should avoid that. Okay, so you got to be careful with that. I want you to try this. Depends on the acting. <laughs> Am I going to make him try it at a piece stage? The other one, yeah, maybe with, maybe with the brown sugar it'll taste better. Okay, okay a little bit will be better. That's what it is. Like, I, don't three like, balls. I don't like three balls. Stuff, so. Okay, two balls. Okay, okay. What? what? It's like a little bit sweeter than the regular. I don't know how to describe it. It's like a whole. It tastes like nothing. I was trying to come up with a description for you, but it really tastes like nothing. It really tastes like nothing. Someone say I'm going through a tough time since I'm unable to see my younger brother, and watching your videos helped me so much. May Allah bless you both, honey. Um, you guys can stay happy, honey. Jazakallah khair. May Allah subhanahu wa taala bless you, keep you happy, and ease any struggle that you're facing. I'm sorry to hear that you're going through that. But things can always get better. Things things can always change with family members. Only Allah Allah knows best, and Allah can change anything. So just be patient. Maybe that relationship will get better. I have to go to bed now. It is eleven eleven in my country. It's ten eleven where we're at. Love your channel. Good night. Thank you so much. I'm not Muslim, but I started to read the Quran just to be educated, and it didn't really make sense to me how stuff was worded. How do you understand things from it? I didn't read a lot, though. Um, I'd say read more of it. If you're starting to read it and it's not making sense, just keep reading more of it and like look up the surahs, look up what the meaning is behind what the surahs are saying. I personally found for myself when I started reading it, I understood it pretty clearly. Um, it's got really good, important information. There's a lot of reminders in there as well. I, the, the way the Quran is just written is just beautiful. It's, no one's ever been able to change the Quran, ever. One thing I like about the Quran is when I open it and I start reading, it's constantly giving me reminders, even reminders that I've read before, because the like, humans are very forgetful. It's just the way that it's just so intuitive, the way it's written. It's like, I can't believe that a man wrote this. I don't believe this is from a man that wrote this book. Okay, I'm going to try to read your session first. Okay, thank you. I just want to say I have a lot of respect for what you guys are doing. Don't let hate get the better of you. People are just jealous because you both are goals. Oh, wow, thank you. Thank you. That's so sweet. Appreciate you. We're going to use our handy dandy ninja. Do you have a smaller cup? I don't want to use a big jug. I don't want to use a big one. What jug? Oh, one. okay. That's huge. I'm not using that. <laughs> and I'm gonna make his mango slushy first because I don't know. I wanted to make it not that, the one with the Let me guess, you don't know where it is. I found it. You found it? Yeah. Okay, they thought. This is It's always like that. You can't find anything that you want when you really need it. Yeah. I'm just gonna rinse it because I'm paranoid and I rinse everything before you Mango boba time! Okay. You guys Let's should use. respond to apostate prophet. <laughs> no. There's really no point There's no in need. responding to him because he has his own opinion and it's not going to change just because we say something. Yeah. A lot of this time if someone calls like another uh, content creator out, it's just it goes to a back and forth and nothing gets resolved. He has his opinion. We've actually contacted him and we've resolved anything that we've had. Yeah, oh, he was very nice about it. He was nice and respectful about it. We've actually reached out to him and everything's fine. Um, we don't have any. I don't have anything against ex-Muslims or whatever. Um, we're just trying to make our videos, guys. People want to drag us into things, I don't know, but we don't like getting into back and forth with people. We just want to have fun. How to add some is hungry for money. Is that his name? I don't know. I don't think my dad will support me if I convert. Well, my dad didn't support me either, so we're not alone. You guys fast. Yes, we do. Yes, we do. I recommend taro powder. It pairs so well with the boba. It tastes really good. 
I've seen that at the store, the taro flavor. <laughs> but we got the honeydew flavor. Just make that up. Mix it up. This is mango. This is mango. We got like, we had some mango and then it was juice, I guess. I don't know. It's actual mango chunks. Do I need the tapioca or can I just have the juice without it? I'm gonna give it to you with the tapioca and without it. Okay, okay, without it, please. Y'all are awesome people are jealous of you guys and they all have died you guys. Um Yeah, I don't know. Alright. Guys, if this makes a loud so sound, I'm sorry. This might make a loud sound. Can you count them in before they know? Ready? That, Ready? Three, two, one, two, it's gonna make a loud one. sound, guys. Cover your ears. It's not that loud. It's not that loud. Though. In case it's disturbing you guys are sleeping. Look at that shake. Okay, now it's gonna be loud. Ready? Oh, sorry. <laughs> okay. Oh, snap. Can Muslims still fast in Ramadan even if they're injured? Yes, you, but you should consult a doctor if you have a certain injury that will prevent you from fasting. Okay, I need a cup for your boba. We got this glass yeah. cup. Now to pour it in. Please look at the tapioca. Please look at the tapioca. I hope we got the tapioca here. This is... this is... Okay, it's flushing. Okay, so the question, is it important to wear a veil because I'm 12 and I'm thinking I'm going to start wearing a hijab, but it's important to wear a veil with it too? According to the opinion that we follow, right? When, you, when a girl hits puberty, that it would become mandatory, that's the opinion that we follow. There is a difference of opinion on the face veil in Islam. I'm not going to tell you again when people ask you, should I convert? Should I do this? Should I do that? That has to be a decision between you and Allah. And, you know, you should, you know, understand why you want to do that, those things, why you want to convert, why you want to wear a face pill. So then you can be firm in your in, in intention and continue to do it. So uh, I can't tell you what you should do and what you shouldn't do. That's, that's going to be between you and Allah. Here, ready? Time to try it. Is Time it, to try there's it. There's a ball in there? Yes, there's oh, balls in there. <laughs> Okay, guys, he's gonna try it. Thank Tell you. me how it is! I appreciate you making it. Um, am I gonna get the ball in here? Yes, you are. The ball! Okay, just me another one. No ball's coming yet. <laughs> how is it? Am I gonna go with book? The balls are just the balls. <laughs> They're just, balls are just the balls. They're just there. They're so mean. I don't know about you guys, but when I drink a juice, even if it has like pulp or something, I'm like, I just want a smooth consistency in my juice. I don't want to have like to where, oh, I'm going to eat a ball. I'm going to choke on a ball. But the flavor of the mango is good. I like it. Let me try Thank it. you. I think you'll like that. It tastes good. Let me try it, guys. I'll it, tell you <laughs> if it tastes like the actual mango. Boba. And if you don't mind taking a few of the balls out when you drink it. No. I wouldn't mean? mind it. Did, did, did you face any problems trying to get married as a convert? Um, how was it? It's good. It is good, yeah. It's really good. Sorry guys, Sierra is meowing in the back. Um, it's actually really good. I did a good job. Problems I face, not a lot there's a few things that happened getting disowned by family was not easy but alhamdulillah things have gotten a lot better since then it was not easy at that time um just losing complete family support because when i converted i didn't have a lot of money or and like support and things like that i was living by myself i just moved out and then i researched islam and then i found islam so that was not easy but also cultural differences between the and i was challenging but otherwise alhamdulillah everything was good Allah made it easy for me. I just pray a lot to Allah to help me make it easier and He make it easier for me. Every time I make mine so <clears throat> It's a nice flavor. The mango slushy, do you like the mango slushy? Yeah, Sierra's trying to get it. Oh, she got it. Oh, How did she do that? I'm sorry to hear that, and I'm really glad that you're happy, yeah? 
Thank you. I was happy even then. It just was like really, it was hard. It was like, you know, when you first move out from your family's home, you think that they're going to have your back. They're going to support you and everything. And as soon as I decide to change my religion, it's kind of like, okay, bye. You know, I don't think it's right to treat your, your family members like that. If my family want to follow, you know, just because you're born into a certain religion doesn't mean that's what, what you're going to want to follow the rest of your life. Time to make mine. I once saw Nakabi lady in the cob flying up, but I didn't want to look. That's good that you didn't. You respected that. That's nice. <laughs> my dad is very Christian, and I have been taught to be Christian my whole life. Me too. And he would have most likely never talk to me again if I converted. Me too. And that's what happened to me. But guys, I'm an, I'm an example, and there's others who are examples that don't let that stop you if you want to do it. You might face difficulties now. But Allah will make things easy for you. I struggled financially. Allah helped me with, with work, to find jobs, right? Things like that. I was alone. Allah gave me Mubina and her family, right? And, you know, sometimes things are taken away from your life, but then something better is put into your life. So yeah, you, you just have to be patient. Hmm? I need the saucepan. You the one with the handles? Sorry, guys. I was in like a That you usually use to make... I was in the mode there. Um, Sorry. No, it's okay. Um... Oh, I washed it. The yeah. one I made back of cheese? Where is the, it? The small pet? Yeah. I'm wash it. You can never find stuff. My struggle is real. I love you guys so much. You guys are my favorite. Thank you for teaching me. It's our pleasure. Thank you. How do I serve Allah when my parents force me to be Christian? I'm only 13 and can't make the choice to convert or openly tell them I want to be Muslim without being Muslim. There's so many of you. I'm one of you. So I know. You one one thing you can try doing is maybe show like that you're researching Islam over time. Maybe uh, try to find similarities between Christianity and Islam and share some facts here and there. See how your family responds to it. My family would not have responded well to it if I did that, but in some cases. If a family sees you gradually researching something, some topic, and then you become, say, Muslim, they won't be as surprised as if you suddenly say, oh, by the way, mom and dad, I'm Muslim now. Because the way I, I had to tell my family, I kind of had to tell them all at once, and they got really shocked and upset over it, and it just got very chaotic. So, thankfully, I was not living with them, so I wasn't there to see what happened, but it got chaotic. I haven't seen my family in, like, over four years. So I hope they're doing good, but things like that can happen, man. Can Muslims be part of LGBTQ+. So there's certain tests in, in this world, for example, like if you're, let's say for example you're gay, in, this, in Islam it's considered a sin to uh, have a same-sex relationship. If you have a desire for a person, there's no sin for that, but if you act on those desires, that's where the test from Allah comes whether you act on that desire or not. There are gay Muslims out there, but, but they don't like act on those desires, if that makes sense. So they wouldn't get married to a man, uh, or otherwise that would be considered a sin in our religion. So some people are uh, given unique tests. However, you are given a lot of reward for refraining from acting on those desires. Allah will give you rewards that someone who's heterosexual like myself cannot get, because I don't have the same tests as you. Everyone has their own tests. Are hot Cheetos or Takis haram? Certain talk there actually is a Taki flavor that we found, a nacho cheese one that was halal. Based on the opinion we follow, che Cheetos where we live generally are not halal. That's the opinion that we follow. So we tend to avoid eating Cheetos. We find kosher alternatives usually for Cheetos. There are kosher ones. I love your videos. You teach people so much. And a question, why did you start YouTube just wondering your story? We started YouTube because I had a lot of misconceptions about Islam as a religion. Uh, that's one reason. Rubina wanted to start a channel, and I was like, you know what, I have a lot of misconceptions about this religion. No. No. Look at no, Sierra no, trying no, to get back. in, guys. Go back. And we wanted to just clarify those misconceptions and show people what Islam is truly about. It's not what you hear on the TV and the media. It's not necessarily what your parents tell you it is. Islam is a beautiful religion. I think of it more of a way of life rather than a religion. So. No, Sierra. Go back. Yeah, it's a lot different than what the media says, the negative things that the media says about it. You guys like mango? 
<laughs> this is really good. I'm trying to get rid of like the balls from here, but the taste sure. of it is going to be really like mango. Solid. Cat scared me. Why do you always say let go? We just say it for fun. It means like let's go. So we do that at the beginning of our videos. The cat's names are, we have three cats. One is Sierra, our baby, who's meowing behind us. Then we have Hazel and Lunar, who are brother and sister. So those two are two years old, and Sierra is one year old. I need to take a picture. <laughs> if you guys do have a question, I, I do uh, kindly request that you do not spam your question, otherwise we will have to mute you. Because it affects the experience of everyone in the live. So guys, please, if you have questions, do not keep typing the same question if I see it coming up every two seconds. I'm going to have to mute you for like five minutes or whatever. Five minutes or whatever? Use your tongue to block the balls. <laughs> I'm kind of worried I'm going to choke on it. I don't really want the ball in my juice. Is it haram to own any other pet other than cats? You should consult with a scholar to know which cats, which animals are permissible to keep. But we have a bird as well. We keep, we have a bird, a cockatiel. So for us, the opinion that we follow, the bird is permissible. Cats are permissible. There's some other animals as well. Some animals have difference of opinion on them. Under certain circumstances, if, if for example, we could, us personally, we can't keep a dog inside. But we could keep a dog outside if we lived in like a warmer place and we had a, a, a comfortable place for the dog to live outside. Or if we built it a nice, a nice house or something. But where we live is too cold, we can't keep a dog. Some people are given exceptions where they can have a service dog. But that's Sierra trying to get in again. Little baby wants in. It's okay, see. Is dog haram to keep inside? For the average person, we're not supposed to keep a dog inside. If someone has a certain uh, need for it, uh, and the scholar allows it, you contact the scholar. Um, some, some people are visually impaired, they can't see, and they need a, 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 a service dog, then that's fine. Here, I'm about to make the honeydew tea, no, so you want okay. to show it? Are eyebrow piercings haram? If you ask them why... why why I have been very interested in getting one, but if it's haram, that's okay. Oh, wow. Smell this. You mean have thoughts on eyebrow piercings? Eyebrow piercings? So, um, I follow the opinion that we can't do that because it imitates uh, people that are not Muslim. So, do you smell it? Yeah, it's not how you do it. smell it. How do you do? No, no smell. No smell? Here. Oh, snap! <laughs> yeah, I do smell that. That was strong. That was strong, right? It's so strong. What are some rules for being Muslim you think are a bit weird? Yeah. I love that. I don't think any rules are weird. I follow Islam because I believe in like everything that it teaches and like, you know. Oops. I'm it. sorry, Livian. I'm gonna have to like put you in time out because it's the same comment. I tried answering it. Does a cat bite or scratch you? I got a scratch here, um, I think it was like a day or two ago. Sometimes Sierra, like she jumped on the chair and she scratched me. Um, but she does, they, our cats never intentionally scratch us. They never intentionally go and like, er, hiss, they never hiss at us. It's just uh, sometimes Sierra gets a little excited. Um, the other two don't usually scratch. Overall, we don't get scratched too much. If you had a dog, what type would you get? Um, there's different. I have like random tastes in dogs. I've had Shih Tzu dogs my whole life, the little small dog. I've had Shih Tzu Yorkie, Australian Shepherd Shih Tzu, regular Shih Tzu. I've had three dogs when I lived with my parents. Um, I like Husky. I like Pug. Pugs are cute. I know some people think they don't, they're kind of, people say they're ugly, which I think is mean, but I think Pugs are cute. What kind of dog would you have, Obina? What kind of dog would you have if you could have a dog? I would have a golden retriever. You already know the answer. No, I don't. It's so cute. Golden retrievers are such cute dogs, guys. The favorite thing about being Muslim is that my whole life feels simple, like weightless. I feel happy. I feel content. My life is very simple. Uh, and it's very structured as well, so I'm happy about that. 
Was it hard for you to give up pork and drinks? I never drank alcohol even as a Christian. I, I never was a fan of alcohol. I never understood the reason to drink alcohol personally. And you didn't like pork that much. I did like pork, but like... It was, you said you didn't. No, I did. <laughs> I, what do you mean? Wow. I, I liked pork, but it wasn't something that I, I absolutely loved and like was, was like, oh my god, no, 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 like super sad about it. Pork is okay. When I was eating it before, like the taste. Um, oh, by the way, guys, we are going to be doing a meet and greet, I should mention. We're going to be doing a meet and greet on this topic now. Halal rib fest. Yeah. So there's no pork ribs or anything. I think it's beef, the meat. I'm not sure what the meat is or chicken. I don't know what, the, what it is. I assume it's beef. But we're going to Halal rib fest this coming Saturday at Downstreet Park in Toronto. From 3 to 4 p.m. we're going to be there. It's like a meet and greet where you guys can come and hang out if you want to take pictures, things like that. It's our first ever one. And we're really excited about it. Um, so if we are a bit shy or anything, guys, don't, don't, I hope that that's okay. Uh, it's our first time doing it. So we have a lot of, we've had a lot of interactions with you guys in public. A lot of people come up to us in public, so we're pretty used to it. But we've never done a meet and greet before, so we're excited. Maybe in Brampton. It's not going to be in Brampton. But if, it, if you are in Brampton, maybe you can come in and hang out if you want. Okay. You can do this. Remember, you want me to shake it on your hands? I'm shaking it. I'm shaking it. Oh, whoa. Look at the... What did you do, honey? Like, what, what's, like, in there? See, I would explain that, but you're too busy talking. I'm sorry. I'm listening, honey. That's okay. I didn't need to. That's alright. That's alright. Don't worry about it. The goat has arrived. Omar Khalil. Omar Khalil, do you not like... Assalamu alaikum, firstly. Um, do you like boba tea? Omar Khalil, let us know if you like boba tea. We're we'll making boba. I love boba I tea. I want this boba. Okay, so they said to shake it for like 8 seconds until you see like this. But what is it called? Condensation? Mm -hmm. And then you just do it's this. It's pretty good. I get it too much. I don't see the hype over it. This is a pretty good mango one. I like this. Oh, I could have just poured it into my cup. I don't know why I didn't just do this. Okay. I'm going to do that now. So I'm going to get my cup. Is that my cup here? Yes, he is. Guys, how, look at my bench. It's like full of stuff. How can you believe in a religion without proof? Well, I mean, when it comes down to certain things, okay, like the Quran, there are certain scientific, like, things that have been discovered that people, scientists are discovering now. So there are scientific... Uh, discoveries that were made back then that people have found now so there is some evidence in the Quran but when it comes to you know your belief in God itself you kind of part of it is having faith there's many times like God has helped me in my life that I know God helped me but I can't I can't physically see God right? but I know God is there so to an extent you just have to have that belief okay Guys, mine is done oh, too. Oh, look at yours. That's a nice little green. I'm so excited, guys. I love honeydew milk tea. Okay, tell me and if I If I nail this, then Garrett, you have to buy me this stuff all the time. Let's okay, see. okay. Ready? Ready? That. I'm ready. One, two, three. Beats get it at the store. You like it? You don't like it. It's good. <laughs> it's so good. Is this Actually, a bit watery? Like a bit watery yeah, it's milk tea. It's not slushy. So this one is a bit of a. a bit of so this is honeydew milk tea. It's not a slushy. I added black tea to it. I added some water and I added ice. I might add a little bit sugar just so it can be a little bit more sweet, but it's really good. That's actually kind of nice. Right? I don't like this stuff. So I think you guys would probably like that stuff. That drink. It's decent. It tastes like the one in the store. Any tips for revert? I've been working on reverting, but I'm having trouble learning. It doesn't help that my parents are Islamophobic, though. I'm sorry. To answer that question, I do not speak Arabic. I had to mute you because you kept asking the same question. Guys, we are trying our best to answer, but I can't get to everyone's question. I'm also talking here as well, so... Apologies if we don't get to your question, but please just try to be patient with us. That would be appreciated. 
you play basketball? I used to play a lot more when I'm younger. We did we did play not too long ago. Bina and I went to go play some basketball for like five minutes. It wasn't for five minutes. <laughs> it was for more than that. I do like basketball. Though. It was for more than five minutes. Yeah, but it was for like five minutes. Yeah, Happy birthday, Molly. Can you tell me your favorite food? Favorite food? Lasagna. Rubina's is lasagna. Mine. Which he still has to make. I really lately have been into poutine a lot. <laughs> I really like poutine. If you guys don't know what it is, it's basically like in Canada, at least. I don't know if the US has it. But it's like fries with gravy and like cheese curds. Sometimes you can get meat in it as well. Halal meat, of course. Um, there's this really good one I get from a place called Chicken Kitchen where they put like fried chicken in it with gravy with mozzarella, a little bit of mozzarella cheese and fries. It tastes really good when they put a lot of cheese in it, but I love poutine. Can you guys do a meet and greet in Brampton in the future? We're not ruling it out. Anything's possible. It could happen. Right now we're doing it in Downsview Park, but who knows. How do I serve Allah when my parents forced me to be Christian at 13? I know, I answered you, I'm sorry. Why is you ignoring me? I'm not trying to. Guys, we're sorry, we're not trying to ignore you. We really you. don't, guys. If you have this many people commenting, it's a, it's a lot. Yeah. Walaikum well, as Favorite animal? Love you guys. Thank you for representing this song, truly. Favorite animal? I, I, I actually had pet frogs growing up. It's kind of random, but I love frogs. Um, dogs and cats are nice too. Lubina's favorite animal is... I know you like cheetahs. What's my favorite animal here? It's, it's, it's the one that's close to a cheetah. What's my favorite animal here? Cheetah. No. Cloud cheetah. Tiger. Yeah. Here, try some more. I added sugar. That's good. How is it? Good. You like it? I mean, well, for boba tea, I like it. In an average drink, I don't like it. I don't. I'm not a big fan of boba teas. Even like fruit juices, I'm not huge on. I'd rather like eat a mango by itself and have this. But if you guys like mango? This is really good. I know Omar really likes this. Yeah. So, uh... <laughs> That's clean. Clean. <laughs> yes, you are famous. I promise you're famous, Omar Khalil. Omar Khalil, you actually have a fan page. Did you know that? Yeah, I saw that, it's funny. Is there like any form of words you can't say, like cussing for example? We shouldn't cuss. We follow the example of the Prophet, Prophet Muhammad peace be upon him, all the other prophets. They don't use like foul language, inappropriate language. They talk with, with respect with everything they say, so that's what we try to emulate and follow. So that's not to swear. I have two fans. Yo, bro. We have people who are guys, we have people who are like reposting our videos too. We have fan pages, but then we have people who are like reposting our videos and pretending to be us, which is kind of frustrating. If you guys ever see an account who's like reposting our stuff, please report that page because it's not us. You'll know it's us. I'm sad. My, my tea's done. So how much powder is left after that in that box? I have... Might as well just get that. Save some bucks. One, two, three, four, five. Five more left. Let's see. So you use one pack? Yeah. So guys, you get this. We got this from like an Asian grocery store. And they come in these little packs. This is a honeydew. It smells like honeydew. <laughs> it so, smells a lot like honeydew. If like, you guys as soon wanna, as you open it, it's like... Yeah. If you guys want to know if this is possible to do at home, Mubina, what, what would you say? If it's possible to do it at home? Yeah, to make boba tea at home. Of course it's possible. I just did it. If I can do it, anyone can. Would you say it's difficult? Uh, no. The only annoying part was the, the tapioca. You had to cook that for 30 minutes, but that's literally the only hard part about it. Is there a way that you can cook a bunch of tapioca and put some in the fridge for later? Or like, do you have well, to Well, I did. You guys saw how much tapioca I used, right? But look at how much there's left. Look, look at this. Can you show it? Can't really show it. Can't show it. Hang on. There you guys. There's a you lot. You can see there's a lot left. Um, you can happily have that, honey. <laughs> so, you can use that over and over again for like your tea. I only use like, maybe not even half the pack. 
I still have like half the pack of tapioca that I didn't cook, which I'm kind of regretting now. I should have just cooked that. <laughs> but it's okay. I mean, this will last me a while with the honeydew shakers. If you accidentally marry a transgender person, the marriage would automatically be invalid, so when you find out the marriage is over. Have you been to Niagara Falls? That's like our go-to spot. We go, uh, we, we've gone there a little too much. Yeah. Uh, we are planning to go back soon. So, we have a Niagara Falls vlog we wanted to uh, share with you guys. It just was having issues when we were trying to upload it. Mubina, can you say Wasika? Wasika. Hi, Wasika. I have been experiencing sleep paralysis. I'm sorry to hear that, Skyler. I hope you're okay. Well, sleep paralysis is very terrifying. I'm Sounds sorry like you're going through that. I'll just run until I give you Shifa on me. Brother Manti slowed down the chat. It's absolute madness. Yeah, it is. Let me see. There is a way to do that. I can do it. Here, I just want to let you know that this is washed. Okay? The red one? Yeah. Okay. Can so you do me a favor? Is it wash? Yeah, so I will I will fix the chat while you wash the shaker, please. Which shaker? This shaker. All three pieces. Right now? Yeah. Well, what, will you need it again? No, I just need that wash because I need that counter space clean. I'll just put it in the sink. Sink doesn't have enough room. <laughs> I won't wash it. Okay, let's fix this chat. Oh, right. Yeah, honey, I'm gonna put it in here for now just because, like, I don't have anywhere to put it. Okay. Put it good for now. I'll watch it. Live chat. Chat in the options. Maybe top chat with the spam might be good. Really? Should we do that? I don't know. We clicked on top chat. I don't know how else to fix that. <laughs> Not mute microphone. I don't think there's a way to do it using this this screen. So we can't do it. It's something that we do at the beginning. I usually do slow it down, but I can't do it right now. Hi, Mobito. Where'd you get your bucket hat? It's beautiful. I got this from Dollarama, believe it or not. <laughs> a lot of the hats that you guys see in the video are from like Dollarama. Yeah. What are your dollars to us, guys? You look so pretty. Thank you. <laughs> guys, all that time and I managed to make two bubble teas, okay? I did nail the honeydew one, so I'm really happy about that. Because that was very good. If you guys can get the honeydew powder, please do get it. Mubina, can you say in Urdu? I Urdu mein kya bolu? Aap kya bolwana chahte? I might come to Mubina. <laughs> I might come to Mubina. I might come to Toronto, Mubina. Oh, oh Rekha Deal, come on! Oh, Rekha Deal, come this weekend, we're going to Downsview. I don't know if you can come this weekend. Adel's going to be there too. Yeah, Adel's going to be there. We're going to meet Adel. The Saleh family is going to be there too. Saleh and Adel are going to be there. And yeah. going to be there. How tall are you two? I'm 5 foot 1 and you are... What? How six, tall are six you? 6 foot 4. <laughs> Minus like... <laughs> Mine is like a I'm like I'm like five five. Bro, I'm like I might have to now. Yeah, it's gonna oh, be great. It's halal rib fest, bro. Guys, halal rib fest. Can you imagine? I've never had ribs before in my life. We're doing a meet and greet. Adlo's doing a meet and I'm greet. I'm excited. Solid family's doing a meet and greet. All, all of us are gonna be there. Yeah, okay, you have to get me halal ribs. Because yeah, I want okay, halal, halal ribs. ribs. Okay, okay, okay. Assalamu alaikum. We do have a lot of similarities uh, with Christians. Not everything's the same. Mira, can your husband speak Urdu? He cannot. I'm sorry. I've never had ribs. Bro, then come. I, I haven't had ribs in four years. I had. I used to have a lot of pork ribs. But, but you've had pork ribs, not like the actual... And y'all had no ribs. <laughs> Do y'all have kids? No, we don't. Not yet. Do you know what the meaning of wasika is? No, we don't. Can you tell us? What languages can Mehdi speak? English. That's it. I understand a few Urdu words when they're speaking, but I don't... I have harder time speaking the language than under I understand more than I can speak. Can I have a sip of the boba? Here you go. There we go. You have the boba. You can have the Look at this guys, he didn't even finish it. He doesn't like it. He doesn't like it. I don't like my boba. Mm -hmm. No. 
I don't like mango flavor. I like my honeydew flavor. There's a reason I made honeydew for myself. Hey, 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 <laughs> hey. Personally, the one who is saying that if my friend thinks it's stupid that I... Well, in Islam, to an extent, we do believe in evolution, but not the type of evolution that involves, like, evolving from monkeys. Humans, we don't believe humans evolve from monkeys. Army of Jungkook, we're not ignoring you. We're having, we're having to read a lot of comments. Pancakes, come If we were ignoring you, we wouldn't read the comment where you ask, why are you ignoring me? Where is Zayna? Oh, Sister. she's in her house. I miss Zayna. I miss Zayna, Sister guys. Mimi! Autistic, autistic Catholic, what's up? OG fan right there. Guys, if you don't know about Zayna, go follow her. She's in our featured pages. She's so sweet. She has her own business. And it's for yes. hijab. She, um, the thing is, her business is called Modest Behavior. And she has really beautiful hijabs. And now she sells jilbabs as well. They're beautiful. Sister Minnie, yeah, Sister exactly. Minnie. Sister Minnie going viral Sister on TikTok Minnie. everywhere right now. Abdul. <laughs> Vina, where are you from? Pakistan. Your kitchen is so com like clean compared to mine. Trust me, it's not. I wish it was cleaner. It's not the best shape right this now. This is not... Like, it was okay before the live, and then uh, Sister Hazel. Sister Hazel. Sister Hazel. <laughs> She's out here. They're all out here. I I would like. This is not my level of clean. I don't like the way our kitchen looks right now. <laughs> Use my bowl, but I mean, apparently they're four hours away. You need to come for the halal rip fest. Come for the uh, okay. I please don't spam, but we do want you at the halal rip fest. Okay, so, guys, guys, we are doing a meet and greet at the Halal Rift but I have no idea what games we can play there. Don't do that. I don't like your I don't, like, I don't like that. Sorry, I don't like that. It just, it feels tighter on my head, oh, and I don't like that. It's beautiful now. What games should we play at the meet and greet? Omar I have Khalil, no idea. How? Omar Khalil, what do we how play do you, at our How do you do meet and greets? We have no idea. I don't know how to do meet and greets. We didn't even know that we would have to, like... Uh, play games or you know interact. We thought that people would just come to our station, talk to us, and take a picture, and that's it. <laughs> Omar Khalil, we need suggestions on what game to play. What game can we play? Halal games. Halal games, yeah. You do autograph. You do autograph. Take pictures. We had well, like a fair amount of people take pictures. We've never done an autograph. <laughs> you guys want an autograph? I'll sign your stuff. Have you been to the New York side of Niagara? No, but we will very soon. Inshallah, we probably will be there soon, guys. We had no passports. We have our passports now. We're ready to go. Bingo? How do you play bingo with a bunch of people? Monopoly? <laughs> I don't know what you'd play with a whole group of people, to be yeah. honest. Yeah. Amazing, but they had Unless bingo. it was like dunk someone in a tank with a balloon, like you throw stuff, like, you know, a baseball game, and you throw it yeah. in a dunk, dunk tank? Yeah. You have like dunk tank there. It would be nice. Play you heads up, up seven up. Omar Khalil, how are we supposed to do that? <laughs> we have a bunch of people come up. Hey, you want to play a game? Heads up, seven up. Water, <laughs> water balloon, balloon fight. fight. Well, see, we're gonna have the water balloons, but no one else will. So how how would that work? Yo, that would be kind of litty. Yo, it Omar, would. pull up, pull up, and let's let's go to the store and get a bunch of balloons and, and load them with water. Can you come? Come this weekend. Maybe you could do a type of guessing game. Oh, I think we could play that. Like, guess this person. Or guess my, how my face looks. You describe the person and then they have to guess who it is. Okay, guess how your face looks. Maybe we can do it here. Guys, let's play guess that, guess this person. Okay? Who is it? Huh? Go get the I have to describe it to them. But you have to give me the person that I have to describe and then I get points. So you give me the person that I have to describe and whoever gets it right, they get can the points. Can it be an animated person or must be a real person? It can be an animated person, but like, uh... Yeah, it can be an animated person, it can be an influencer, it can be someone that's online, anyone. A character in a show, anyone. Okay, so I'll tell you who it is? Yeah. Yeah, so he's gonna tell me and then you guys have to guess. Okay, no one knows her. Okay, I can go. Huh? Okay, okay guys. Guess this person, okay? Ready? He has no nose. He's pale white. Sounds like me, that's the photo. That's easy. He has no nose, he's pale and white. <laughs> oh, he gets it right okay, away. That's easy. <laughs> I got another one. Okay, 
Okay, so this guy is is in a show. He's in a he's in a Disney show. Um, he's animated. He's very tall. He used to be a basketball player. His face never shows up. Um, and looks like me. He's right very now. yeah. He looks like him right now. <laughs> So his face never appears in the show, and he actually has rivalry with one of the main characters in the show, and uh, he's very, uh, very arrogant for being rich. I don't even know if you guys have seen this Disney show, but it was recently rebooted. Not LeBron. LeBron James? No. 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 Not LeBron, but no. He's in an animated show, guys. It's not like it's not like a real life. Ad he was in the show Proud Family. Come on, guys! She just gave me the hugest hint. Come on, family, say it. The proud family. Come on. Proud, proud family. Come on, come on. <laughs> Seriously? No, I don't. <laughs> Not two shoes? Who's goofy? Whoa! <laughs> the guy who doesn't show his face is a proud family. Come on. The, yeah, the guy no, that no, is no, not very proud. proud. Not no, very no, no. proud. It starts with a... Oh, yay! Yeah, someone guessed it. <laughs> okay, Wizard Kelly. Yeah, the wizard. <laughs> you got it, you got it, you got they it. They got the Wizard Kelly. Good job. The tall dude. You never see, yo, do you ever see his face? No. Isn't there a it's... show, isn't there a certain show that shows his face? No. I want to see his face so bad, it was frustrating me. You're a wizard, Harry. Yes. <laughs> okay. Okay, so, this guy was, um, he's a wizard, and he's also in the Harry Potter world. He was in love with Harry's mother. So easy. Bro, I feel like, I feel like it's so easy. Ron? Ron was in love with Harry's mother? mother? Oh, snap. <laughs> oh, snap. That's twisted, y'all. That's a plot twist. Hey, Christian coming. got it. Christian got it. <laughs> no, y'all said Ron. Was it something you said before that made them say Ron? Yo, you still you say know, Ron Weasley? That's kind of whack. <laughs> you love Harry's mom? Snape. It was Snape. Harry's dad. No, it wasn't Harry's dad. Yeah. I don't even know who that is. I don't know who that is. Okay, so this guy is in one of the shows we all don't like, but we watch anyway. <laughs> it's not the most appropriate show. <laughs> Everyone is yellow in it. And he is one of the most psychotic characters in this show. Yellow show. He right? has his own... Uh, he's not yellow, actually. Is he yellow? I don't he's know. He's one of the few characters who are not yellow. Yeah, he's not yellow. He's actually not yellow. He's not, no, he's not Minions. Homer, no. it's not Homer. Homer's yellow. It's not Homer Simpson. He's one of the most Yo, psychotic... No, someone guessed the one that I said. I actually told her Sideshow Bob first, but then she's like, I don't know. <laughs> no, I don't it's know not Sideshow Bob. Okay, so it's not Minions. It's oh, like, okay, what's the name? The Clown and Simpsons. What's, what's his it? name? What's his name? Say his name. I'm worth a Leo. No, not Guru. Come on, guys. Come on. <laughs> really? Yeah, Lynn got it. Krusty. Oh, yeah, Khalil, you're like 50%. Krusty the Clown. Oh, you took a hard minute to get Krusty. You know what's cool is that Universal Studios actually has a whole Simpsons world. If we do get to go there, I really want to try their donut. You know that Homer Simpson donut? Honestly, I'm not going to eat the whole thing. I just want a bite of that donut, like a little tiny bite from like the side. Okay, so this character everyone loves. Especially me. <laughs> Especially him. And he's in one of the most popular shows out there today. It's a Netflix show. And it's the most it popular show ever. And oh, whoa, you got it, you got it. <laughs> wait, wait, say the full name. <laughs> <laughs> well, you didn't even have to take time. <laughs> Damn. Steve Harrington. Okay, that was easy. <laughs> Dang, how did you do that? Okay. okay. All right. This character is from the same show that we were just talking about right now, the most popular show on Netflix. And uh, his character is the most plot-twisted character ever because he's not just one person. He's like three in one. 
He was in the last season of uh, of the show. <laughs> Mike? What? No. It's not Mike. It's not Mike. Yes. Um. But what's his name? Which one? Which one? He we, has like three different titles. Say all, say all the names. Dusty Bun. Dusty Bun. No, it's not Dusty Bun. Which, which one? Yo, get his name. No, Beck you got two, guys got two out of three. What's the name? Vecna one. What's his name? Someone said Vecna one. No. It doesn't matter. It's still Vecna. Whether you call him one, whether you call him like, uh. You don't even know his name. Vecna. <laughs> no, you don't even call know his him name. one Vecna or what's his name? <laughs> Yo, I don't know his name. <laughs> <laughs> I, I don't know. I forgot his name. Or was it like? What was his name? No, what's the guy's name? What's one name? I forgot name, his guys? name. It, like, I just blanked out. I knew his name and then I blanked out. What was his name? What's Yo, no one knows his name, fam. We all forgot his name. No, no, no. His actual name. The guy's actual name. It's not Nancy, yo. Henry. 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 Okay, you yes. win. You win. Yeah. Zon, you win. Okay. Huh? Uh, I don't know her name. I forgot her name too. I just why am I blanking out her name? Okay, I'll give you another one. Who was that again? Huh? Okay. All right. So this character is in the same show. I don't know why. But he keeps giving me the people in the same show. And why are you doing that? Why are you doing that? Mm -hmm. Last one. It's literally the same show. Okay, this character's in the same show. She's actually the sister of one of the main characters. Oh, come on, bro. You just gave it away. How did I just give it away? She's very attitude-y. She's very sassy. I really like her. She is fun. She is awesome. And I don't think Vecna could ever get to her because I feel like Vecna would be we'll scared of her. We'll switch the show for some of you guys who have, do not watch. My sister. <laughs> so it said my sister. I know some of you guys don't know the show, so we'll, we'll switch it. No, it's not Eleven. It's not Eleven. She's the sister of one of the main characters, guys. So yes! Erica. So yeah. I'm G Gina. I'm sorry if I pronounced that wrong. You are slaying Erica, it. Erica, You yes. are slaying it. So good. Nancy Wheeler? No, no, no. It's not Nancy. I'm running out of shows because I don't watch many shows. Give me characters. You don't have to give me characters from shows. Character? What kind of character? Or people. Like, I have to describe them. You can give me an influencer that everyone knows. A famous influencer. Okay. Okay, this guy is one of the most controversial influencers out there. I've never personally subscribed to him because I never really understood the hype. But he used to make a lot of, like, Arab videos. Uh, my Arab parents did this. My Arab parents did that. And then he uh, kind of grew from that he went to la he lived there for a while got like homeless yes <laughs> Fussy too. Oh, got it. <laughs> Fussy too. It is Fussy i actually too. watched him a little bit before he did start like got kind of off track but i don't know him okay well go ahead i don't know him Guys, this guy's all over TikTok. I have no tornado, idea what he said. Vida, vida, tornado, vida, vida, and everyone tornado, talks about him. I, and they say he's like a role tornado, model for people that are Muslim, but really he isn't. He's just like a very misogynistic guy who just says the nice things about Islam because he thinks Islam is misogynistic. Yeah, we're Khalil got it. Andrew Tate. Andrew Tate. Andrew Tate. Yeah. What color is your Bugatti? <laughs> My Yo, friend. Andrew Tate got removed from like Instagram and like everywhere. <laughs> Yo, Andrew Tate got removed. He did? Yeah. From everywhere? Yeah. Well, good. Thank God he got him in. He's so misogynistic. Okay, so this guy is in a lot of movies, a lot of comedy movies, and um. He, okay, we want the actual name of the actor and not his characters. He's done a lot of different characters throughout his movies. Not It's not Ryan Reynolds. He's not Jim Carrey. He is a comedian, but he's not Jim Carrey or Ryan Reynolds. Not Kevin Hart either. He's not Kevin Hart. He is tall. He is 
Heart Jewish, I believe. <laughs> is he? <laughs> He's, yeah, he it's is. not he Seth is. Rogen. He is. It's not Seth Rogen. Adam Sandler, that's right, Liz Wei. You got it. <laughs> they got it. Yeah, Adam Sandler. Johnny Depp, no. He doesn't do comedy. Huh? Huh? <clears throat> so she is the wife of someone that was in Pirates of Caribbean. Oh, come on, bro. That's so easy. <laughs> Forget that. He just gave it away. <laughs> Let's see if someone gets it with that hint. Go fast, whoever gets it fast. Okay? <laughs> <laughs> Ever. Chris Rock. Oh, said Chris Rock. Why? Why Chris Rock? Why Chris Rock? <laughs> No talking about Amber. Oh my god. Amber. Amber. Yeah. Okay, we're gonna do one last one and then we're gonna end our live. This was a fun can I live. Do it this time? Yeah. Can I give you. I have to give it to you? Yeah, I, I don't I don't know any other people's. Okay. Um character or person. Hmm. Yeah. I don't know many people. Okay. I don't know anyone either. Okay, okay. Uh. Oh! Don't scream it. Don't scream it. Woo! Oh! <laughs> oh! Yo, my ear's ringing. Why'd you do that? Oh! Yo, don't do that. Oh! Hola, soy Dora. Bro, you like damaged my ear. <laughs> I'm sorry. I love you. Oh! Come here. Why'd you do that? I'm sorry. <laughs> Hola, soy Dora. Back, 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 back. Uh, yeah, no. Okay, let me do it. Okay, this character is in an animated show. It's uh, one of the most popular animated shows. I heard it's so. based under the sea. Um, she actually is a character that does not belong in the sea, but she's in there anyway. What is this character? She lives in a dome. Sandy. There we go. So okay, my turn. Why is her name Sandy Cheeks? Sandy Cheeks. Why is her name Cheeks? I don't know. Okay, no. Yeah, what? That actually really hurts. Sorry. Yo, what do I do? I okay. thought I was going to use your character. Don't, don't speed promise. Okay. It's okay. 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 Um, so this person had a lot of movies, and and they slapped someone on a stage. <laughs> what? And now their career is over. Their career is not even close to over, come on. They slapped someone on the stage, and... <laughs> Will Smith, yeah. Chris no, Rock, no, no, not Chris I said Rock. they slapped someone on the stage. <laughs> Will Slap? Say my name. Will Smith, Mel Gibson. No, it's not Mel Gibson. What? Haji, Haji Hamza. Sorry, Ubina, I gotta go. You're I not answering one. me. I got one. Ahmed, what was your question? I'm sorry, I didn't know what your question was. What? Okay, this guy's a Bollywood actor. Is one of the biggest stars in Bollywood. One of the richest stars in Bollywood. Top of his day. Top of his time. I didn't, I didn't know who he was five years ago, but now he's like my favorite. If you guys watch Bollywood, you'll know this guy. Omar okay, Khan. Okay. Yeah, okay. everyone knows him. He's actually the most known person around the world. Dua Ahmed Khan. Yeah. Not me. It's not me. Is this Garrett? No, it's not Garrett. <laughs> All right, guys. Do a hard one. Okay, guys, we're gonna end the live now. I wanna do one more hard one. Okay, do a hard one then. It's a hard one. What's a hard one? It's like a really random, like, I, like see, the problem is it's either easy or it's like really hard that you guys won't, are not old enough to know. I want to do one that you guys wouldn't know. Mm. It's a hard one. Give it, give it. Okay, we're going to do an influencer. Here. Let's do it. No. Come on, do no, it. No, I'm not doing that. Come on. I'm not doing that. Why not? I promise I'm not doing that. Pick someone else. Pick someone else. Don't scream. I can't hear. 
So this person makes videos. They're an influencer. And they make Islamic videos. I don't want to give you any hints. <laughs> They're a nice person. Okay. <laughs> How did you know? I give you like no hints. I didn't say anything about him. How did you know? Wasika, I'm not ignoring you. You're you're here. What's oh. in your messages? Bro, that's too easy. Exactly, oh. I know. Okay, is there like a Muslim influencer that's not easy to know? <laughs> I gave you one, but you didn't want to do it. That's, that's, uh, I'll give you another one. You want to Okay, so these people are influencer. Okay, they make videos. <laughs> they make Islamic videos, and they try to be nice. They, they. No. Mubina TV. They make videos. They try to make you smile. No, it's not in Java. Okay. They got it, they got it! Ah! It was Medina TV! <laughs> Omar, you tried this game, it's not easy, yo! Okay? You know everything! Adam Saleh. <laughs> yeah, it's us, guys. Saleh. It had to be us, okay? You gave a hard one. That's it. That's it, so guys. Easy. I know, we're easy, okay? <laughs> okay, now to fix my ringing ear and take my I'm mango. I'm sorry. Juice. Guys, look at this! He still hasn't. <laughs> so mean! I feel kind of insulted because you didn't drink it. Do you even like it? He doesn't like it. He does not like it. But guys, the next time we're gonna make uh, <laughs> butter beer. We're gonna make butter beer from Harry I'm Potter. I'll finish it, guys. I'll finish it. I feel ignored, Sailor. No, don't feel ignored. Don't feel ignored, I'm guys. I'm so sorry. Last one. Oh, okay, what? Okay, Omar. Which one? Okay, I got one. What? Okay, this character is also in the Harry Potter world. Um, Make it on the obvious. I want you guys to struggle. He's in the Harry Potter world. He's not actually a main character. He's not actually any type of character. Um, he was there for a few minutes in the movies. <laughs> in one of the movies, he was there for a few minutes. Yeah, so I'm gonna mess and, you guys up now. And <laughs> Uncle? No, no. He was very, very tall. Very, very tall. Mess very, up, very, up. like... Non human. The owl, Draco. <laughs> no. Very, He's very just tall. In the corner. <laughs> very, very non human. Barney Crouch Jr. Mess up, guys. Ha! No. Not Hagrid. No. Hagrid is a main character. He's not in like a, one of the movies for a few minutes. Not Dudley. No. Well, I don't like Dudley, but. <laughs> LeBron James? <laughs> I haven't watched Harry it's Potter in five years. Guys, I promise that that movie is. Omar Khalil, you don't need to watch the movies to know this character. Okay, it was literally just... like in the first movie. It's not hard. Okay, then what's the answer? Shaquille O'Neal. Okay, you guys. They're in this. Okay, you're... one of you is close. One of you guys said something that was close. They're big. It's it's, it's huge. Not, it's not a human. It's not. A it's human. not a human. It's huge. It lives in the dungeon of Harry Potter. It's in the dungeon! It's in the dungeon! Someone got it. Dungeon. Someone got it. Hafsa! Yes, Hafsa Khan. It was yeah, the troll. Yeah, the troll. The troll really stick the wand up its nose. Yes. Ha! Stump yes, y'all! Yes, guessed it stump after you the dungeon. The only way to stump you guys is to pick random characters that like appear for two seconds. Who has seen the- who has actually read the books? Sluffy. Be honest. <laughs> Who's actually read the books? And please be I'm honest. honest. Did you guys know that there's a poltergeist character in it that the movies never mentioned? Did you guys know that there were actual um that were there were actual elves living within uh, the castle? What's the castle called again? Hogwarts. They were living in Hogwarts, and Hermione was actually um, doing a protest to free them 
all from Hogwarts because they used to uh, make the cook, make the meals. You guys never knew who was cooking all of those foods, right? It was the elves that were doing it the whole time, but you wouldn't know because you haven't read the books. I got one. <laughs> no, you don't got one because we're not doing more. <laughs> okay, fine. That's it, guys. All right, Achieve guys. Yeah, we're going to wrap it up now. It's fun. Yeah, it's, it's really fun. So. I don't read either. I love reading, guys. Okay. It's so good. Time for you to eat your juice. All right, guys. We're guys, gonna... if, sorry. If you like this live, smash the like button. You guys gave it 313 likes already. I love you guys. Get it to 400. Please. I love you. <laughs> Go ahead. All right, guys. Until next time, assalamu so alaikum, and don't miss our meet and greet on Saturday. It's happening at Halal Fest down to you Park. Follow us on Instagram for details, guys. Come here guys. to meet us. Bye-bye. Assalamu alaikum. Wa alaikum assalam.